People should make New Year's resolutions if they're actually watching this video on January 1st. If they're watching it on December 23rd, they should make December 23rd resolutions. Waiting miraculously to when the calendar flips to start making your life better is silly at best and pisses me off at worst. And so whenever you're watching this, because it lives on the internet, and thus that means you can watch this on June 17th, 2017, make a resolution every day of your life because you only get one at best. Realize that right now you're about to create a real future that can make a major difference for you. That right now you're not just writing words down on a page. That even though you don't know how this is going to happen yet, that if you get something that you really want and you make it strong enough and you find strong enough reasons, you will find a way. But I also know that there's tremendous power if you get committed enough. The reason people struggle with having a New Year's resolution and sticking to it is because it was a tactic to do a New Year's resolution. Hence why my first answer was right, which is when you actually decide to make a change in your life, whether about weight or job or going out with somebody or relationships, that's when you actually pull it off. It's religion, not tactics. You don't get in life what you want, you get what you fight for. And when you decide that my future, my health, my marriage, my freedom, my happiness, my joy, my peace, my children is worth fighting for, you are securing your break. Have you ever asked yourself the question, why haven't I done the things I wanted to? Have you ever wondered why others seem to get the breaks in life and you were stuck in a dead end job, a marriage that was over a long time ago, a condition that is debilitating you physically, emotionally, mentally? Why haven't you realized your dream or why did you give up your personal power and why are you feeling as if you're a victim of circumstance? Nothing, absolutely nothing is impossible. You can begin again. You can believe God again. You can trust again. You can be successful. You can overcome your addictions. You can heal. You can feel alive again. This is when you realize that those things are possible. You are getting a breakthrough. Can you see it? Can you believe it? Walk over and tell somebody this is my year. This is my destiny year. This is when I step into my purpose. This is when I step into my purpose. This is when I step into my destiny. This is when I get my act together. This is when I get my head on straight. This is... This is your year. This is your year for destiny steps. This is your year to do what you couldn't do before. Go where you couldn't go before. Be what you couldn't be before. This is your year. Make you understand that the major mistake that everybody makes is waiting. Waiting for somebody to pick you. Waiting for the right time. Waiting for you to feel motivated. It's not coming. For the big stuff, for the hard stuff, it requires a push, always has, always will. Nobody is coming to save your ass. It is up to you. And so if you want to change anything about your life, stop sitting around and wasting your goddamn life and start pushing yourself. Whether it's a fast or it is starting a business or it is changing how you talk to your spouse or it's changing the kind of parent that you are, you got one life. You never know when your time is up. But I do know that you've got time right now to change things. And so the thing you should change is you should take 100% responsibility for your future. You should decide what is it that you really want your life to look like because you only get one of them and it's not going to start again. But you could start building your future right now. And that begins the moment that you realize that you're never going to feel like doing the things that are hard. You're never going to feel like stepping out of your comfort zone. And the second that you do, the second that you push through, you win. You win because you see yourself becoming the kind of person who takes action. You see yourself believing in your ideas. You see yourself disregarding your own excuses. That is the source of confidence. It's the willingness to try. It doesn't start with belief. It starts with the push. So do yourself a freaking favor and stop thinking about all this stuff and stop commenting and push yourself. Do something.